James Kaufman, World News Report, today, October 13th, 2024. God bless you and yours, no matter where you are in the world. Please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, ring that bell for critical future updates. After a few quiet days on our sun, we just saw an M3.42 solar flare from our old friend, Sunspot AR3848. We also had a sympathetic solar flare at the same time out of Sunspot 3855. Let's get some more information about those events. All right, ladies and gentlemen, they have not assigned the M3.42 solar flare to a Sunspot group, but we'll easily be able to tell when we get to our ghost solar ultraviolet imager at 195 angstroms. You can see that we just had the M3.42 which did in fact originate from our old friend AR3848. It's been so nice to us. It is in fact headed around the limb, but that won't occur for another day or two. Today we had only a 10% chance of an X flare, only a 55% chance of an M class solar flare, and we've been running a C baseline for months now. You can see that AR3848 is no longer a Delta class sunspot. It's a beta gamma sunspot. So it's not as complex as it was when it hurled several X flares out towards Earth. Now let's take a look at HMI Intensigram. We can see 3848 headed towards the outgoing limb here and trailing it 3855, which appears to have produced a sympathetic solar flare about the same time. Now, all in all, we have seven named sunspot groups Earth-facing, although I think that we'll have, well, more than that tomorrow, because I don't think 3848 will be quite yet around the limb. Now, we do have some sunspots that are directly Earth-facing, including 3852 and 3854. So, let's hope that those stay stable and don't send any packages our way. Headed over to our ghost solar ultraviolet imager. First, we'll see 3848, that M3.42 flare, and the sympathetic flare coming from 3855 right behind it. We'll watch one and then the other. We also have a small coral hole in the northern hemisphere that's about to be Earth facing. Now, according to our D Region Absorption Prediction Center, this was not very geo-effective towards Earth. The CME, if there was one created, probably went off in another direction because we don't see a lot of radio alternation or X-rays hitting the planet here, even for an M3.42. This obviously occurred over New Zealand, Fiji, Papua New Guinea, and parts of Australia. In summary, we have no Delta sunspots on the Earth-facing side of the disk, 3848 is beta gamma, 3849 beta, 3850 alpha, 3852 directly Earth-facing beta gamma, 3854 directly Earth-facing beta gamma, 3855 that actually produced the sympathetic solar flare after 3848 shot the M3.42 off is just a beta sunspot group. And finally, 3856 is a beta sunspot group. I guess the most complex sunspot group is the one that's directly Earth-facing here with 15 sunspots in that group. That said, God bless each and every one of you guys. Please share, subscribe, and always remember, anything's possible. Bizarro world.